the stations of the cross with the presence of saint joseph and all the angels all the saints from heaven to be with us in the stations of the cross and accompany jesus who carries our burdens to mount calvary who carries our lives to mount calvary and crucify it once and for all and transform into his body and give it back to us let's all pray together with the preparatory prayer we come into your presence o lord accepting your invitation to take up our daily cross and follow you the path of our life has been strewn with moments of pain and sin you were sent by the heavenly father to take upon yourself this burden of our earthly sojourn carrying the heavy burden you have gone ahead and carrying the little burdens of our life we want to follow you in the past we gave into self pity and gave up altogether on hope and slipped into dark despair in such moments your face was not visible to us we thought we were alone with this way of the cross we remember you will never leave us alone as we follow your footsteps we want to offer to you every form of grief that burdens our mind every sickness that cripples our body every bit of sin that enslaves our soul we have the confidence of faith that when we offer these burdens of our life to you our cross will share the glory of the calvary cross mother mary and saint joseph as you walked in the footsteps of your son to calvary walk with us teaching us to pray your prayer here am i your servant let it be done to me according to your word the first station jesus is condemned to death we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world it was so painful to see my son bruised and bleeding standing before pilate and it was even more painful to hear the shouts of the people around him they were screaming for his death crucify him they shouted release barabbas and yet what did my son do to deserve this he healed the sick raised the dead fed hungry and yet the very same people are here now screaming for his death i wanted to plead with them to tell them to stop and just cry out release jesus but i know as i look at my son his eyes seem to say i love my people mother and i am ready to die for them my children even today you seem to be making wrong choices on whose side are you on barabbas or jesus why are you rejecting the truth and pursuing false gods whom do you choose today the world and all its pleasures or jesus my son the source of eternal salvation have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us mother of god plead with your son second station jesus carried his cross we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world after the scourging you could barely recognize him he was so weak from the loss of blood i wanted to just hold him and say son let me hold you but to my shock i saw the guards dropping a heavy wooden cross on his broad shoulders he bent under that weight and they showed him down the road laughing and mocking can you imagine what this did to a mother's heart i wept silently knowing that he loved his people and was ready to die for them 
my child the first teaching of my son was to take up your cross and follow him i know some of you feel so helpless in this situation but do not despair hold on to the cross for happy are they who patiently endure trials because they will receive what my son promised to those who love him have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us mother of god plead with your son third station jesus falls the first time we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world i saw my son stumble as he walked down that dusty road how painful was the cross as it dug into his shoulders then i heard that thud my heart stopped for a moment i saw him fall to the ground that heavy cross landing squarely on his back i thought my son was dead my body began to tremble as i saw the guards kicking ferociously they whipped him asking him to get up i could see him trying so hard to rise but he had no strength left oh i wish i could take the whip out of the soldier's hand but all i did was weep silently because i knew that he would go to any extent out of love for his people even to the extent of dying on the cross for them my child when you fall into sin do not despair and give up rise for my son loves you so much that he is waiting to forgive you no matter how big your sin is Have mercy on us O Lord Have mercy on us Mother of God Plead with your son Pray for us sinners Mary most pure fourth station jesus meets his mother we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world i somehow managed to press through the crowd and reach out to him i was there standing in front of him our eyes met and i wanted to cradle his bruised face in my arms i often did that when he was a child he would shout mother and i would rush to him today i could hear his heart screaming mama and my hands rushed forward to hold him but the soldiers pushed me away as i looked into his eyes it spoke volumes don't cry mama i love you my people and i'm ready to die for their redemption My children today many are separating me from my son when you refuse to honor me as his mother you separate us pray the rosary children and you will be blessed have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us mother of god lead with your son pray Fifth station Simon of Cyrene helps Jesus to carry his cross. We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. How was he going to make it to the end? I could see his complete helplessness. The soldiers too noticed it and they dragged a man named Simon from the crowd and forced him to pick up 
the back of the cross so that he could lighten my son's load i was pained to see simon reluctant at first i moved forward i was willing to help because it's my son after all i couldn't bear to watch him so helpless but they pushed me away so i followed silently knowing that my son loved his people and was ready to die for them my children even today you can be a simon and help lighten my son's load by reaching out to those in need have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us the root god lead with your son sixth station veronica wipes the face of jesus we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world i suddenly saw a woman push past the guards and began wiping my son's face at last somebody has compassion towards my son i was so pleased to see her boldness and lo and behold i saw an imprint of my son's face on her veil he rewarded her for the kindness and her name was veronica you can be a veronica today when you wipe the tears of other people the world is hurting and they need somebody to console and comfort and when you do this you will see my son's face imprinted on your heart Mother of God plead with your son Have mercy on us O Lord Have mercy on us Mother of God plead with your son seven station jesus falls the second time we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world once again i see my son fall he was whipped kicked and driven like a beast i tried my best to move forward as i could hear his heart cry bama they began whipping him as they think that would make him rise i wanted to scream stop i wanted to cover his body with mine so that the whips could fall on me i am his mother which mother would keep still and silent seeing her son tortured so brutally then they caught hold of his hair and pulled him up his hair braided with blood i could see the look of pain on his face my mind went back to those times when i would stroke his hair with love but today i watch helpless stifling my sob my son so loved his people that he was ready to be tortured out of love for them my children however hard it may be don't give up come get up you are addicted to drugs alcohol pornography and you think there is no hope don't stay down rise and begin to walk in the paths my son chose to walk for love of you have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us the road god lead with your son pray for us sinners mary most pure aid station jesus meets the women of jerusalem 
We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Despite all the pain and bleeding, I saw him stop and console some women crying for him. He asked them not to weep for him, but to weep for themselves and for their children. As he could see what was to befall them, there was compassion in his eyes. My children, today I see so many parents weeping for their children. How many families weeping for their loved ones? So many weeping for the loss of jobs and financial crisis. But remember, just as he consoled those women then, he is consoling each and every one of you. Do not harden your heart. Receive his love and consolation. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Mother of God, plead with your son. Pray Nine station Jesus falls the third time. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. He falls again flat on his face. As I watch him, I notice bits of stone and rock embedded in the flesh of his feet. I thought I would rush and pull them out. It would give him some relief. But then they dragged his body, they kicked and beat him. My mind raced back to the time when he was a child. I would kiss his tender feet. I would put those little sandals on his feet and caress them. But here, as I watched his feet covered with blood, my heart broke into a million pieces. The sight of my son in such pain was unbearable. But I knew he loved his people and was willing to die for them. My children, please don't give up hope no matter how far you have gone away from him. His love will not give up on you. Come back, children. Come to your mother and come to my son. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Mother of God, Plead with your son, pray for us sinners, Mary most pure. Ten station, Jesus is stripped. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. The soldiers did not stop their torture. They immediately started to rip the clothes of his body. In doing so, they ripped his skin off too, which was stuck to his clothes. Then they began clothing him with their spittle. I wanted to cover him with my mantle and hold him once again. Today, as I watched him being stripped, I feel so helpless. My mind raced back to the time he was born. I wrapped him up in swaddling clothes to cover his nakedness, and I held him close to my bosom. Oh, my son, I cried silently knowing that he was willing to go through all this pain out of love for his people. My children, strip yourself of all pride and of ego and of anything that is not of my son's kingdom. Children, some of you are riding in shame and guilt because of past sins. My son, endure shame so that you could be healed of your shame. Let this shame he went through not be in vain. Forgive yourself, my child, children, for my son has forgiven you. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Mother of God, plead with your Son. Pray for us sinners, Mary most pure. 
11 station jesus is nailed to the cross we adore you o christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world they threw him on the cross and they began stretching his hands and feet to nail him on the cross as they raised the cross i could see his agony he was convulsing and not able to breathe i wish i could take his place and die but i knew he loved the world so much that he was willing to die for his people children as you walk through life you are going to be crushed and broken through false accusations a false rumor a betrayal from a loved one even rejection from a spouse it is going to crush you it will feel like the nails piercing through your hands and feet crippling you completely but children remember my son he went through it all uniting your suffering with his and by using it redemptively you are journeying with jesus have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us mother of god plead with your son station Jesus dies on the cross We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world I watched him suffer on the cross Those 3 hours were like 3 years for me I was wondering if there was any way for me to climb up there to kiss every wound every bruise on his face i was wondering if i would find a basin of warm water and wash his nail pierced feet as he washed the feet of his disciples would somebody just take me up there and let me hug him as i did when he was a child when he screamed i thirst i was looking for some water so that i could quench his thirst when he cried out father why have you forsaken me i spoke and said no son your mother is here i had not left you for a moment with the words father into your hands i commend my spirit he breathed his last i could not understand what kind of love he had for his people as he was willing to die such a brutal death my children no words can describe the sufferings my son went through because of his love for you and it pains me when so many blame him for the problem they go through when there is a calamity they blame him when there is a sickness they blame him tell me child what more could he have done when he went to die on the cross have mercy on us o lord have mercy on us Mother of God, plead with your Son, pray for us sinners, Mary most pure. Thirteen stations, the body of Christ is taken down from the cross. We adore you O Christ and we bless you because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world Two men took the body from the cross and placed it in my arms I once held his body full of life as a child and now I once again hold his lifeless body and I gazed and gazed at his face tears began flowing down my cheeks I remember those moments that he wiped my tears so lovingly but now I was alone even Joseph was not there to console me and though his eyes were closed in death I could hear him say weep not mother 
I love my people and I willingly lay down my life. My children, come as I hold my son. I want to hold each one of you, so broken and battered by life's circumstances. I know what you are going through. I feel your pain. Come, come feel your mama's warmth. Before he died, he said, John, behold your mother. And he gave me as a gift to each one of you, his own mother as your mother. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Mother of God, plead with your son. Fourteen station, Jesus is laid in the tomb. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. They laid him in the tomb. I did not want to leave him. I wanted to stay close to him. I never left him for a moment, except when he was lost in the temple. But when they closed the tomb, I knew I would be separated from him forever. What else could I do except wait in faith? My children, I know what it feels like to lose a loved one. But remember they are with me rejoicing. They are in a better place. So don't grieve anymore. Release, let them go. We will all meet in heaven one day. Have mercy on us, O Lord. Have mercy on us. Mother of God, plead with your Son. Closing prayer. Lord, I have walked with you following your footsteps on the way to Calvary. But your journey did not end with the cross of Calvary or at the dark tomb. It proceeded to the glory of the resurrection. Your resurrection was the first fruits and the promise is for every one of us that we also will be raised to life. How glorious indeed is the light of your resurrection. We remember the promise that if we die with him, we shall also live with him. Our one prayer is that the rays of your glorious resurrection shed light in the dark moments of our life, leading us to your presence. Amen.